Getting the MCC cape was actually much easier than I thought it would be. be like, for example, that yellow like, yak, yak task. I thought it would take 100 games in order to complete it. Apparently, it did not. I experienced two glitches during while playing Meltdown minigame. One was making it easier while the other was making it harder. Harder. I... I'll, I'll cover those glitches in another video, but they definitely, like, the one that was making it easier for me essentially helped me just complete the minigame in five rounds. Though, realistically, if I wasn't experiencing seeing those two glitches, it would have probably realistically taken me around ten rounds to complete that yellow yak task. Echo Soldier just tips definitely also helped out like collecting focusing on like collecting sugar cane while wearing the purple panda hat really really had helped i think reduce the amount of rounds to just three really helped me to just complete the task with in three rounds um for the grid runners i think you, my tip is to basically with the froggy hat task when that uh, arena fighting timer like gets to gets near around five, just be at the door right away, because what I learned is that when you're at that door right away, it gave me just I was able to like paint more, get more blocks painted. I think when I wasn't at that door right away, that I was only getting like around twenty block blocks painted, and so I. Th I think pretty much I had to play like nine rounds of grid runners. I think I might have done somewhere between 15 to 20 rounds of Sands of Time. And yeah, it pretty much took me a minimum of just four rounds of Ace Race. Also, when you get this crown painting up here, you're supposed to use some white paint. Like, because that's what the painting has.